Hello everybody, my name is Andrew Fire, and welcome to Let's Play Don't Escape 2 the, out the Outbreak And this game is supposed to be much more interesting because I heard it's got like a bigger world that I can actually explore in And like I said in the last one, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to figure this out because I'm not sure if my brain is that good But we're gonna give it for a test My head Alrighty, so let's see Oh, when the undead attacked, we weren't ready. Thinking back, we were never fully ready for this. Oh, let me click. The whole outbreak started after two weeks ago, and it's been getting worse ever since. This time, we, we barely made it. We got away, but Bill got bitten. We both knew what that meant. He's gonna turn into a zomboid, and all crap, my headset is running out of battery. We decided to stay in this abandoned building for a while. We needed to rest and sleep. A huge horde of the living dead is coming this way. They will reach us by the sunset. I have to lock the place up before it happen. And maybe, just maybe, I will live to see another day. Alright, so this is gonna be interesting. So, so this got like a different concept. So I can, so, in like the last game, it's like, the don't escape. This time it's don't escape, but you don't want to escape. You want to lock yourself away from the zombies. So, typical, you know, use the usual stuff that you see in horror games. Oh, is this Bill? My friend Bill, he's been bitten. The pain, can't stand, can't stand the pain. Don't worry, bud. I'm going to try and look for help. Window, there's some sand inside. Okay, so I'm assuming you can make concrete and then cover this window up that would sound good because looks like a pretty vulnerable broken glass window zombies can just break through a shovel oh okay it's got the shovel uh 18 oh okay wait i have a time system eight hours and zero minutes left that ain't good the hatch is locked so I'm using I have like some time system. I'm assuming. Oh, okay, it's a good place for a trap. So I'm assuming this is gonna take a lot of building. And every time you build, it will take up time. So, but I'm not really sure because I don't have much. Ooh, I found a key! Ah, okay, is there any more can I quit this dumpster anymore until I find something? No? No, I could okay then. I see fences, so that's good. Uh, ooh, I see an area. What's that little orange thing? Ah, bullet. Small metal cutter. Ooh, maybe I can use that for the padlock. Let's go for the padlock. And we're gonna cut it. We're gonna snap it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I didn't even think that was gonna work. Ooh. So, oh, man, this is creepy. Oh shit. Well, I wonder, you know, how how that's gonna work. So, I don't know. I'm assuming I'm gonna have to kill Bill later on. You know, it's a sad thing. Like, why do I have to kill Bill? I don't want to kill Bill. Bill's my best friend. I'm new since kindergarten. Oh, what's the? A generator is not running. Oh, seems to be out of fuel. Oh, so I can look for fuel. A broken gate. I could fix it with some spare wire fence. But well, what do I have? I have wires. Uh, ah, that would make sense. Okay, but I need fuel, and I need to fix this fence here. So can I go out? Like well, I could do. It. Oh, that's how this works. Huh, interesting. Oh, okay, so then it takes off my time every time I walk there. A canister? Cool! Oh, it's empty. Can I use one of these? Ah, Come on! Out of order and out of gas. Frick. 9mm bullet. Uh, anything else? Okay, out of order, out of gas, out of order, out of gas. Now go to gas? Okay. So, bottle of water, some battery, ooh, first aid kit. Ah, okay. 
So I can probably use it. Oh, why? So I can probably locked. Okay. So I can probably use it to so that way I can like um. Oh, okay, that one goes up. I can only go to this part of the gas station. Apparently, don't much. Huh, my lucky day, a single coin. What am I gonna do with a, with a coin? I don't know, maybe there might be a working vending machine. Get a can of pop. Okay, um, how about the next unknown location? Oh, dental store. Uh, survivor. Okay, hi there, I'm Jeremy. Okay. So, uh, hi Jeremy. Uh, sorry, I can't see you, I want my glasses. I, ho I will gladly help you if I find my glasses. I'm, I'm lost them somewhere in that store. Oh, okay, so, cart, oh, but it's a place with a chain. Maybe I can use this, uh, this? Oh, okay, that makes sense. So, my guess I can use the cart to carry heavy items, maybe, I I'm assuming. A child drawing. There is hope. Huh, you're right. Just getting a building. But, uh, okay, so. I hope they're okay, whoever and wherever they are. Huh, <laughs> right. Okay, so. Oop, no. Uh. So, I guess I'll go in the store. Ooh, I hear that sound. What's that? Instant camera. Okay. So. A bottle of alcohol. Alright. So, anything else? Can I get another coin? Oh, it's empty. Alright. Uh, ooh, is there a basement here? Let's put that. Oh! Hey! You, uh, zomboy! Okie dokie, pair of glasses. I have to get rid of the undead first. Alright, well, what can I do? Not with my bare hands. Well, you can use it with a flyer. Or you can just burn them in there with oh, it's empty. It's empty. It's empty. Alright, fine. Well, I guess, I'm guessing because I have to collect different locations. However, I'm assuming... Ooh, I know what I can do. If there's somebody who sings, I'm assuming that in the game I might find somebody who is going to be all like, like, Oh, there is no hope! Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so I do just take pics, uh, take pictures of random things, maybe? I don't know, yeah. Alright. So, there's a, there's a place down the road. Seems to be damaged. Oh, I see. So, not much left of it. Seems to be undamaged. No fuel. Oh, fuel tank is intact. Uh... Well, I'm not really sure what I can get here. Ooh, a gun! Must have been after the boys. Possibly must have been killed by the zomboids. Okay. Nothing useful here. Nothing useful. Stop sign. No fuel. Blah, 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 blah. Nothing, nothing useful here. Man, it's just a whole bunch of rubble mess. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to find here. Okay, well... That crash side is pretty useless. Okay, so then there's a... Uh... Oh, it's a church, okay. An axe. This will come in handy? Okay. Uh... It's too heavy to carry around like that. Oh, okay, so that's when the cart comes in. So we're gonna get the cart. Okie dokie. And then... Oh, okay. And then I guess I can use this cart to carry around the bag of sand. There we go. Alright. I got an axe, so I wonder what I can use that for. Let's go to church. Um, nothing useful in here. Uh, uh. Oh! There's a, there's a pastor in here, huh? I've lost my faith. There was no hope for any of us. Just, just leave me here to die. I've lost my faith. No, I'm not leaving you to die. You lost your faith. Well, how about I show you the child drawing? Maybe that'll help you. Yeah. Is it? Oh. Oh! It worked! I was right! Oh, I... Oh, maybe. Maybe you're right. I'll think I'll go with you. Maybe my faith is somewhere out there. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's somewhere out there. What's the exit point? Yeah, I'm gonna shoot before you get point. Alright, so, are you with me? Oh, you are with me. He's in my inventory. Okay, okie dokie. Father Bernard. Alright, nice to meet you, Father Bernard. Alright. So, oh, I have an act. I'm assuming I can go back to the gas station. And, uh, what I can do is I can bust down this door. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Let's see what's in here. A short rubber hose. Uh, an aquarium. All the fish are dead. Venture novel. Venture novel. Criminal story by someone called El Doc. Book. Nothing interesting. Who knew gas station workers would read that much? Probably the gas station would read that much. Maybe they just had. Oh, and I found a bullet. Interesting. Uh, shame I don't have time to sit and rest. Oh, a small window. Alright, well, so what did I get? Oh, I got a rubber. Ooh, I know what I can use a rubber hose. Okay, remember that that, uh, that the fuel, that that one fuel tank at the crash site is actually, uh, is actually intact. So what I can do is that I can use this. Ah, there we go. And then, you just get... Yeah, so now we got fuel. So I can use the fuel for the... Um, for the canister. Okay, so now I have a gun. So what I'm assuming, I can go back to the gas station. So I'll go back to the gas station. Uh, yeah. No, I'll go to the shop. And I'm gonna get this guy's glasses, and I'm assuming he's gonna help me, right? I mean, you better! Alright, let's see. Uh. 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 Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, well, I'm gonna kill you. You know? Time to load up the bullet. Get shot in the fucking head. Oh. Are you sure you want to use a gun to shoot the undead? It will consume bullet and make a hell of a lot of noise. That's fine. I don't really care. Alright, boom. Alright, so now. Get the pair of glasses. There we go. Alright, now. Wait. Get out and give him the freaking pairs of glasses. Here you go, sir. Here's your glasses. Oh, shoot. Right here. Thank you. In return, I will help you. Okay, let's go. Lead the way. Alrighty. So, so, so that's what those people are for, is that they can help me. So I'm assuming I got everything. So now I'm gonna head back to the base. Alright. Okay, so, this will only take two hours, okay. Man, that took up a lot of time. Okay, so then what I can do is put fuel in here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so I'm assuming that's on now. Maybe, I'm not sure. Okay, so now... Um... We need to do things here. So we can build a trap here, but uh... Oh, shoot, I don't have it. Oh, that's what I should have done! You doop doop a doop -a doo what an idiot! It was a whole thing on logs right here. So I need to chop that. No? Well, what the frick? No? Hmm. I'm not sure. I need to find some wood. Can I find some wood? Woody? Wood? Ah, there we go. Okay, so, uh... Seems to be on there. Okay, so now I have some wood. So let's go back. Ring a dang. Alright, so now! So now we got the wood, so then, because I remember we built a trap, so... Man, I'm just, I, to be honest, I was just clicking all over the place to find things. So I'm not sure if I'm using my head, but I seem to be doing pretty good. It'll only take one hour! Geez. That takes up a lot of my time. How much hour? I only have a couple hours and ten minutes left. Okay, so, uh... 
Then we can close the door, and then we can use this key to unlock the door, right? Yeah, there we go. Alright, so now... So, oh, actually, hang on. Yes, I know, hang on, let me get the key. Okay, so that's what the trap for. So that's good, because zombies will just be dumbasses and run straight into it. Ah, I knew something wasn't was weird about that generator. Cause I always, cause remember, always go back to check. Man, but I seem to be the smart one around here. I love this game. I'm so smart at it. Oh, okay. So here, I'll give, I'll give him some painkillers. Ah, thank you. Ah, the pain has gone away. Thank you, but I'm still infected. I don't know how much longer I can hold it together. I love to drink some booze before I. Oh, okay. I can help you with some work if you want. Oh, sure. You can help me with some work. Thank you. Alright, so, uh... Oh, I know what I can do, because I have a bag of cement. So what I can do is pour water in this. There we go. Then put the cement. Oh, no. The cement. There we go. And then we use the shovel to mix it. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. So now, we're gonna brick. Yeah, it's 35 minutes, no problem. All right, so because I gotta have everybody's help now, including for Jeremy and Father Bernard. Okay, so, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to kill Bill. So I'll give him a bottle of brew, because that's what he said you want. Hick, okay, so now he's asleep. So, oh, I see. I should have. I should have locked the door. I've almost forgot about that. There we go. Lock the door. All right. Sorry, Bill, but uh, I'm gonna have to kill you. I'm gonna have to kill you, Bill. Sorry. <laughs> Man. There, Bill drunk, then we are you sure you want to put the gun and shoot Bill consume when I make a but at least we put it into his misery. I know, just it, it's just like so because he you know he can't live anymore because if you're bitten by a zombie, he's possibly gonna turn into a zombie plus he's in pain, so nothing I can do about it. That's life. Sorry. I know it's harsh. Extremely harsh. So I'm assuming I did everything, right? Yeah, I just have some so I don't really have any resources left, so I am going to wait. There we go. Now, oh, undead. The sun has set and a horde of 50 undead arrived. Okay, that's a lot. Your reckless shooting has caused an additional 10 living dead to show up. What? Reckless shooting? That's bullshit. The fence was your first line of defense. Powered by the generator, it fried five hungry undead to quiff before the electricity went out. After the generator went silent, the fence stopped 15 rotting monsters before the rest of them took it down. 15 meat craving fruit got stuck in uh, the trap, piercing themselves against the pointy stick. Yeah! Breaking up the window was a good idea. 10 undead uh, corpses tried to, un to, en tried to enter your hideout. Through the window, but ended up helplessly, helplessly scratching the brick. <laughs> so, locked door held up long enough to make 10 running monsters lose interest and wander off. <laughs> Okie dokie. You were hiding in a cellar, hearing angry growls above your head. The, the hatch was squeaking under the feet of the undead. There wasn't enough of them to collapse the hatch. After several hours, the morning stopped and the undead wandered away. Yeah! And then, there was silence. You, Jeremy, and Father Bernard have survived the night. It's time to move on and leave this place. Unlock achievement. The survival. Complete the game and survive. The merciful. Make sure to go over the savior. Save two of your friends. Ah, okay. Cool. That was great. That was beautiful. But I wonder when everything goes horribly wrong. That's what I want to know. What goes horribly wrong? Cause you know, 
If we good, everything just goes horribly wrong. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I'm just gonna wait like here eight hours. Cause you know, every we're all gonna die. The sun is set and a horde of 50 undead arrived. The broken fence didn't stop anyone. There was nothing in their way in the front yard. The door was wide open, Attack attackers simply entered your hideout. Bill was not giving any signs of life for a while now, until that moment when he suddenly stood up, joining the ranks of the undead. Oh, I knew it! I knew he was gonna turn into a zombie. You didn't have a gun to defend yourself. No place to run, no place to hide. 51 of them attack you, knock you down, and slowly ate you piece by piece. Wow. Okie dokie. So, that's, uh, Don't Escape 2. So, I think that's everything. So, thank you all so much for watching. Please check out the other videos I've done. I've done some wet plays with the tablet in the past. And so, be sure to check out uh, the first part in the description if you haven't watched the second part. And so, thank you all so much for watching. And as always, stay on fire, my friends. Bye-bye.